In this video, we will be making these fun and colorful button necklaces and bracelets. They're the perfect fashion accessory to make for a loved one or for yourself. But please remember that they should not be given to babies or small children. So let's get started by reviewing the supplies and tools we'll need. Buttons Elastic cord Scissors And a ruler Step 1. Choose buttons we are going to begin our project by picking out some buttons. Your necklace can have as few or as many as you want. Just keep in mind that your necklace should have an odd number of buttons. That means a number that can't be divided into two equal groups. This includes the numbers 3, 5, 7, 9, 11, 13, 15, and so on. For my necklace, I'm choosing 11 medium-sized buttons in a variety of colors. Step 2. Measure and cut elastic cord. Now we are going to cut 2 feet or 24 inches of elastic cord. I like to lay my ruler down and spool the cord over its length to get my first 12 inches. Then hold the cord where it begins on the ruler and spool out another 12 inches to make 24. Then snip it off with your scissors. Step 3. Add buttons to string. Line your buttons up in the order that you want them to appear on the necklace. Then find your middle button by counting from the outside in. Take one end of the cord and put it in one of the button's holes from underneath. Then thread it back through the hole opposite of the first hole. If your button has four holes, it should look like this. Then adjust your button so that it is centered on the cord with the two ends at the same length. Now repeat by feeding in the buttons on each side and bring them towards the middle. Keep doing this until all the buttons are on. Step four. Tie a double knot. With all your buttons in place, we can tie off the elastic cord. Grab the two ends and wrap them around each other like this. Then grab the two ends again and wrap them around and carefully pull them tight. Then trim. To create a bracelet, we are going to follow the same steps as the necklace but use smaller buttons and a shorter cord. When you're done picking them out, spool out only 9 inches of cord and add your buttons on starting with the middle and alternating, meaning going back and forth from side to side. Tie a double knot and trim. Note that this knot will be a little bit harder to do than the necklaces. And that's how you make button necklaces and bracelets. You can choose buttons of any size from mini to jumbo. They can be in rainbow or black and white. You can also change the color of your cord to match. You can even use buttons with different shapes. There's no limit to your imagination.